Uh, my name is Richard and I work for Local Futures in Ladakh. I first came in 2003 when I worked on a village farm for a month and I've come back uh, on and off ever since uh, trying to encourage that kind of deep tourism which I distinguish from shallow tourism. Local Futures is an organization that is international uh, and promotes localization, which is the idea that uh, the economy is better in small units than large units, which favors uh, large companies which can then dominate economies and countries even. So it's an international organization based on that principle. It's also had a lot to do with Ladakh because it was started in Ladakh and it runs this project where people come and uh, live on farms. Uh, I've seen both good and bad. I think the cultural exchange is very good. Uh, so it's great to see a, a young Westerner integrating with a young Ladakhi and talking about things. And I really enjoy when I see that. So there's, there's that good aspect. Also, it's bringing money into, into lay, so that's a good thing. So if I was a rich computer whiz kid in Bangalore, and you know, I want to come and see Ladakh, I'm going to come up here and spend money. And that's a good thing. It distributes money around India. Uh, Negative impacts, yes, certainly. Unfortunately, uh, the fact that tourists like to use water toilets is such a shame. If they could only learn to use the Ladakhi toilet, uh, that would be so good because uh, then they'd actually be benefit the following year when what they produce goes out on the, on the land. So I think the main thing is to make people aware. And of course, once people know, then most people behave responsibly. So uh, that's the key. So, and we're also working on that uh, education of tourists. A simple thing like just learning a few words of the language. It's so, it's so kind to your hosts. And for a long time, Ladakhis felt backward, not in the world, but as part of India, because they didn't feel that they were getting a fair share of the profit that India was making in various ways. Uh, so I think possibly when Western tourists came here and started to interact with Ladakhis, it almost like jumped that. And the Ladakhis thinking, well, uh, these Western tourists are coming here and we must have something beautiful to show why they were coming here. So I think when you interact, if you can show them the respect for, you have for this beautiful place, for their customs, for their gentleness, for the two religions that live side by side, Buddhist and Islam, and also some Christians, uh, and really try and immerse yourself in it rather than seeing it superficially. Then you'll have a greater time yourself and you'll also make the Ladakhis feel better that you've come here to, to interact with them.